Ah, oh, good morning. Welcome once again to OneCoin. It is good to see you. You can see I'm on a slightly funny angle here. It's just because I'm looking at the other monitor. I've got a brand new game for you guys today. It's finally that time. Uh, it just came out a, a couple hours ago, actually. We've got Bloodstained Curse of the Moon. Uh, you guys probably know what Bloodstained is by now. It's by that game, uh, new game franchise by the guy that used to produce Castlevania. It's really, really awesome. The brand new Bloodstained just came out today. And uh, really, really looking forward to playing it for you guys. And then as a bonus, we're going to be doing the first game on the same stream as well. Uh, so yeah, thank you very much for coming. Going to say hello to everyone in the room. we got Gamer Dad and JK Software. And uh, over on the uh, the Facebook, we got Jax from Blast Processing Video Games. Lovely to see you, Jax. Thank you so much for coming in. And uh, we got Adam there. we got Jeremy, Chris. we got Tori. we got Milton. we got Anthony. we got Dave. we got Rick. we got Selena. we got iJazz. We got David, we got Mo, Tracy, Steven, Nick, Andrew. Man, this room is filling up. Thank you so much. We got Reed, Nick. Uh, we got Alex, Thomas. We got Susan, Joseph, Rodney, Dave, Jason, Kat. Appreciate you guys all very much for coming in. We got Sam Blasted Gaming. We got Big J Laws as well. We got Steve. Man, you guys are nuts. All right, we're going to go to the main screen. We're going to get started. Speaking of main screens, I've got a, I've got one brand new star screen. I worked on one more shuffle video last night, just in my travels. So, not not a whole lot. I'm going to do a whole pile of new star screens. Um, hang on one second. I'm going to do a whole pile of star screens uh, at the end of the weekend. But I made one tonight. There you go. So Beto just sent 185 stars, and Alvin just sent 100 stars, and Jax. Once again, our good friends at Blast Processing Video Games just sent 200 stars. Thank you, Jax. And, oh my goodness. Alright, this is going out to you guys. I am evil Homer. I am evil Homer. I am evil Homer. I 200 evil indeed. Homer. Guys, thank you so much for the kind star donations. That's really, really incredible of you guys. Yeah, no, this one just came out today, Jeremy, so I don't expect you to have heard of it. It's brand new, mate. It's brand new. Hey, gone, Robbie. Hey, gone, Johnny. Thank you, Dave. Dave says he likes my shirt. It'll look even nicer when, when I get rid of this little beach ball underneath it. So, Veronica says we should be friends on Switch. We can make that happen. Oh, I'm going to play on casual. Okay, so I don't know what to do, guys. As I said, I haven't done the sequel yet, so this is going to be a first time. Hey, go on, James. Wonderful to see you, my friend. Thank you for hanging out. You like the evil Homer? Thomas dropping a big 100 stars. Thomas, thank you, thank you, thank you. This is for you. Hey, go on, James. Good to see you today. I'm doing okay. I'm still trying to wake up for the day. As I said, I've got my water here. I've got my energy drink. I went to bed early last night. I just didn't fall asleep. Sean says, stop your skinny. I'm skinny fat, so I am pretty lean, I am pretty skinny, but I do have a little bit of a beach ball on my belly, so I'm like what they call skinny fat, and uh, <laughs> Jameson, thank you, Jameson dropping a big 200 stars, thank you Jameson, here's a lot of love from me and the Tyson family, my friend, Jameson with a big 200, this day and age, reading and good news on the yeah good on you Jeremy, thank you so much. David, good to see you as well. David dropping a big 200 stars. David, this is for you. Thank you, David. John. John, I'll try and find the Highlander. And let me just see where I, where the Highlander is. Here you go, John. John with 100 as well. Thank you, John. I'm not sure yet, Joey. Pro oh, my God. Drake also with the 200 stars. Drake, thank you very much. Thank you, Mikey. Oh my gosh, it's so hard to keep up with everything. Thank you so much for coming in, though, everybody. Drake also with a big 200. Always good to see you, Drake. And, uh, I don't know if I'm doing The Walking Dead or not. I do actually want to do The Walking Dead tonight. It depends how much time I've got left. Uh, but we are definitely doing Walking Dead in the next couple days, either way. So here we go. Thank you again, Drake and everybody else. This is, uh, the new game. Let me know how the sound is before we get too far in. Is it loud enough? You need more juice? I probably need to give it more juice, hey? Let me, let me know how this goes. Alright, just gonna pause over here. 
Joseph with another... Oh my goodness. <laughs> I can't keep up, man. Joseph with 150 stars. Thank you so much, Joseph. All right, Snake. This is for you, Joseph. Are you ready? Hey, God, Andrew. We got the gaming twins in the business. Thank you for hanging out. More juice. Yes, I've given it a bit more juice. Let me know how that goes. Oh, boy. So Susan says you're loud, but I like you. Yes, I'm loud and obnoxious and Australian. It's a great combination. There you go. It looks, it looks like the, same, the characters are the same as the last game. So this is pretty cool. A Andy says it's good now. Hey, go on, Matt. Good to see you, Quincy. Good to have you as well. As you can see, this place is just like Castlevania and like uh, a Ninja Gaiden. I'm not sure which way to go. We can go up or down here. There you go, little demon cat, little fucking cat. All right, let's go. <laughs> uh, what's been going on? And now, now everything's a little bit calmer. What's been going on with everyone today? What's news with you guys? Any interesting stories Uncle OneCoin should know about? Sounds all creepy when I say it like that, doesn't it? There we go. I'm playing this uh, for the first time with my uh, uh, my Switch Pro controller, which is really, really convenient, I must say. Susan says, you got to remember you're deaf, so you can hear me in there. Oh, no, I get it. No, you're good. By the, by the way, guys, I don't know if you saw my post last night, my regular page, but I was bitching about EA because I bought a game that didn't work. It wasn't letting me on the servers. It turned out it was a different bug, but I managed to get it working. Uh, so, yeah, that's good news. I, I, I bought uh, Plants vs. Zombies 1 last night. I know it's a really old game, but I love the survival mode on it. And it wouldn't let me go on the servers, so I thought they were deactivated. Uh, it turns out that EA had some kind of account issue, and I had to, like, recalibrate it or something. I contacted support, and they fixed it for me, but... Good news was, it wasn't my fuck-up. The bad... Yeah. Anyway. Let's just... Let's just move on. So, so, Andrew says you work 10-hour days Monday through Thursday. Man, you're a workhorse, sir. I hope you're getting enough rest. So Andrew says Plant vs. Zombies is a sweet game. Yeah, I've got Garden Warfare 1 and 2 and uh, Neighborville. I haven't tried Neighborville yet. It, it's hanging there for a rainy day. Thank you, Dave. Yeah, it's good, man. We're going with the classics. I was trying to tag this game, uh, but for some reason, Facebook Gaming didn't have a tag for this game, so I had to put Castlevania, which is probably only going to help us. Jeremy says you tried playing NBA 2K20 recently. And quit playing within minutes. Uh, I actually really enjoyed the game. I played NBA 2K20 and did the career mode until the cinematic was finished. So I played it for about four minutes and then I didn't really play it again. I, I may end up getting 2K21. It looks pretty good. But uh, we'll see how we go. Edmund, this is the brand new Bloodstained uh, Curse of the Moon 2. It just came out today. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Rio says Bloodstain's a cool game. It really is. You know what would be cool right now if I actually got some health, huh? Fuck it, man. This first level's a bit of a handful. Oh, he's a bit of a jumpy, jumpy cat, isn't he? Jeremy says, felt like an idiot trying to play NBA 2K20. Had no idea how to play it. Oh, there's a bit of a learning curve, man. After all, those games are a simulation. And, uh... NBA 2K21 is going to cost more, yeah, so, so I've seen. It's okay, it is what it is, huh? As, as long as they don't load it with a ton of greedy DLC. But we all know what 2K is like. <clears throat> yeah, man, just came out. Hey, go on, Sylvain. Thank you for coming in. Don't forget, as a bonus on the stream, we're playing the first game as well. So JJ says, how much did this game cost? Uh, 22 Australian dollars on the Switch. So what's that US? About 15? Yeah, you're looking at about 15 US for this game. Oh, so okay, I'm just trying to get... Oh, okay, no worries. Oh, we got him. Sweet. So Jeremy says you're great at 2K20 even though you play one-handed. Jeremy, that's pretty, uh... That's pretty impressive, sir, to play one-handed. That's a gift. I hope you document that. <laughs> Yes, that's really, really good news. You, you do know I like Keith Lee. How long do you think it's going to be until he's on the main roster? You want the Mumba Forever Edition? I think that's the one I'm going to be picking up as well, Quincy. 
Oh my goodness. If I'm missing any comments, please let me know. I, I don't mean to be rude, guys. Doing my best here. Good to see you, Lynn. Thank you for coming in. JK Software says he finally beat Castlevania 4 yesterday. Oh, so it's just like, looks like a back and forth pattern here. Pretty straightforward. I like that this time around the bosses actually have a health meter. In the first game, they didn't. And this is very convenient. Go back over here. All right. It's all very highly patternized, this one, which you would hope so, being the first boss. This is, this is nothing that we can't handle. Although, we're running out of uh, magic items there. All right, hang on. Get back off him, ya. All right, so now we got to go back up here very, very quickly. Okay, so there's the secret. There we are. I mean, this is highly pat nice. There's nothing we... Yeah. I, t I have one thing I have to tell you. When I first played Bloodstained Curse of the Moon, the original, it took a little bit to get used to, but because I've played this game, that game so much, now that we're playing the sequel, uh, it's very easy to adapt to. Like, I, I, feel, I feel very much at home here already. Alright, we got him. All good. But sometimes they'll do like an attack at the end where they try and get revenge. What's that? What's happening here? Oh shit. Hey look, I've got a friend here to help me. Don't get cocky kid, I'll try not to. How you going Gus? Good to see you. No, it's on everything Randy. It's, it's This game is on everything. I just picked the Switch version so I could travel with it. We got a big, big, big thank you going out to James. James has just sent a very generous hundred stars. Thank you so much James. This is for you. Oh yeah. Mega, yeah, mega, yeah! Big thank you for the love today, my friend. Yeah. Mega powers, yeah. How you going? We got Player 40, we got Joshy in the Hizzy. Good to see you, sir. It, it's pretty much the same as Castlevania, but with a different name. Like, the guy that made this game is a former producer of the Castlevania series. Thank you, Daniel. You're too slow, Zangetsu. I felt the target before you. You have some nerve using me as a decoy. Come on, I had no choice. You're the only person I could rely on for this. Let me lend you my strength and we will slay those demons together. Dominique has become an ally. Dominique can kiss my big fat ass. Alright, there we go. Let's let's go, Dominic. Uh, what, 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 what's, what, 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 what patterns has she got that's helpful? Let me, let's, let's just read this. High jump, B button. Alright, here we go. Alright, so I'm just working out the high jump. One more time. B plus up. Alright, so she just jumps higher. Alright, so she can bounce off things. Alright, there we go. So that works. What about this one? Alright, that'll do. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> right, thank you, Luther. <laughs> hey, God, Andrew. Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. I guess we'll just go the next level. It all looks pretty linear right now. Working it out as we go, guys. Working it out. This is basically the new Castlevania of 2020. That's exactly how to describe it. Alright, so... Oh, right, yeah, she does have a pretty high jump. Oh, crap. I'm gonna try and only use her when I need her. Hey, gone, Raj. Thank you very much for coming and welcome to the stream. I am doing good, Raj. I'm just really... Uh, just really getting into this game. This game is awesome. So, Peyron says he's been going to the gym uh, as of late. Congratulations, man. That is a very, very big step to make. How's it all going, Peyron? And we got a big shout going out to uh, Rhonda Rantel. And a very, very big happy birthday to you, Rhonda. We hope you have a lovely day. I appreciate you hanging out, girl. Much love to you, my friend. I hope your friend uh, Jacob is looking after you today. I would recommend it. I mean, first, my first impressions of this are very good. Don't forget to like and share the stream if you can, guys. It really helps us out. I don't know if we're supposed to go across in here or just this way. I don't know. We'll just keep going this way for now, I guess. There's like, there's like branching paths in each level and you can find like little secrets and... Probably not going to discover all of them today, obviously, but 
we'll work some out as we go along. You're chilling too, you make a girl, you make a guy blush girl. Who you talking to? Who, 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 who you macking on, Andrew? Return of the Mac starring Andrew. Return of the Mac. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Don't ever sing. Yeah, we're getting pretty close, Randy, hey? Sylvain, I, I think I think uh, our YouTube will end up blowing up eventually because we've had some really nice growth there lately. Well, there you go, look at that. Well, that's pretty cool. Have I ever played Trove? No, I've heard of it, Quincy. I've never played Trove myself. I've heard, there's, there's so many games I'd like to try, but just don't have the time. I don't even have the time to scratch my balls, mate. There you go, that's a bit vulgar, isn't it? Sorry, ladies. <laughs> Oh, gosh. And, uh, uh, Lynn's not doing too well. Hope you're feeling better soon, Lynn. Sorry if you're going through a tough time. And, uh, alright, one second. Alright. <clears throat> alright, so what's in here? Oh, there's a secret door. Oh, that's neat. Let's have a look at what's in this one. I don't think there's really anything else we can grab in here. Alright, let's leave. Marcus dropping the big $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Marcus. Appreciate you coming in. What am I getting uh, my nephew for his birthday? I can't tell you on camera in case he's watching because the family sometimes watches. But I've, I've already bought his gift and it's ready to go. So Marcus dropping a big $5 super chat. Thank you, Marcus. And we're going to do the new one for you once again, my friend. This is for you. James also with the two th 200 stars. This is for you, James. Thank you, Marcus. Thank you, James. <laughs> you guys are awesome. Again, I can't thank you all enough. Yeah, man. I, I did that Ecuador uh, track finally. It's really neat. I ought to go back into this game. Oh, here we are. And uh, if I'm missing any comments, forgive me, guys. Everything's a bit hectic. Good to see you sneaking in, Mikey. I see you there. Thank you for coming in. Oh, damn. So it's hard to keep my rhythm. Alright, that's alright. Let's just last as long as we can with this. The good news is I think this has got infinite checkpoints. So it's not like we have to go all the way back to the beginning of the level. So what do you guys all got planned for your weekend? We've been thinking about the weekend yet. Only one day of the week to go. And, uh, alright, back over here. I'm just gonna go up that little staircase. I'm sure these bosses are only gonna get more difficult now. But I have to say, the first boss was pretty straightforward. It wasn't really a, a much trouble at all. And, uh, those look like those annoying little things from Ghosts and Goblins. You know those flying pork chops from the first level? That's what they look like. See what's over here. So Mikey says he's working. It's pouring all day tomorrow. I've actually been having a bit of rain where I live as well lately. It's been uh, well, it, it kind of uh, cancelled my evening walk last night, which was a bit annoying. I like my evening walks. It's the only exercise I get. So Conrad says your girlfriend and you were taking the kids to Branson. So what, what's this Branson business? I, I don't. What, what is Branson? You're taking him to Richard Branson's house? That's terrible. Uh, no, I honestly don't know what Branson is. It sounds like an interesting place, though. How you going, Tony? This is Blood. Uh, this is Curse of the Moon 2, my friend. This is brand new. This just came out literally, like, a few hours ago. Like, I'm playing it straight away because I'm awesome. There you go. Look at Rick having tickets on himself. Look at him swinging it in the breeze. One coin only is hot dogging. <laughs> Hey, how you going? So D Wayne says he'd love a flying pork chop. You know, come to think of it, I think I would too. Thank you, Mitch. Well, man, it was a no-brainer. I've been waiting for this game for about three weeks ever since it got announced. Oh, and now, now that we've got a brand ah fuckity, now that we've got this brand new game, I'm wondering if they're making a, a sequel to uh the other one. All right, we have to go back over here. It's all right, guys. We got this. Just takes a little bit of focus, guys. Gotta make sure I don't make so many mistakes on the jumps. There you go, we're gonna we're gonna go all the way back to the flying pork chops. That's fun. Hey go on, Nick, good to see you. I'm doing very good, thank you, man. 
You have good news and bad news. All right. Well, what what's your freaking news, Nick? As long as, long as more emphasis is on the good news, no worries. Well, that's right. It's not unlocked yet in the USA, is it? No, I feel ya. Well, I got lucky, didn't I? Look at Rick being all special and playing this before you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I have to go back to this sumbish. Oh gosh, come on! These are just as annoying as the Axe Lords in the original Castlevania, hey? Hey, going cruise? Good to see you. Saving money on car insurance, but the bad news is I still have to pay the aforementioned car insurance. Ah, oh. Leroy Jenkins. Man, I've always got time for Leroy. You know this cruise. You know I've always got time for Uncle Leroy. Right, back over here. Ah, oh, damn you. <clears throat> deep breath, Rick. Deep breath. Hey, how you going, Alan? Yeah, man, this is a sequel. We're finally doing it, huh? I mean, I, I think you already know how excited I've been for this one. Gosh, okay, so there's like ghosts coming out of just thin air and everything. That's always a good time. Uh, hopefully you're almost up to this boss. Andrew says, been having a crappy day, had to get tested for COVID, now waiting for the results. Well, Andrew, look at it uh, from a different point of view. As long as you're not like really, really sick and hard of breath, uh, man, be thankful, worst case scenario, all you're going to have to do is isolate. You'll be okay, bro. You know what I mean? Just make sure you don't give it to anybody else, and it'll be over before you know it. Alright, there we are. You think by tomorrow I'll be able to give this a speed run? I, I sincerely doubt it. Look well, this chick, she looks like my ex-girlfriend. Look at her laying all sexy on the... Oh, never mind. Oh, okay, well she doesn't look so sexy anymore. Jesus, what the fuck are you? Alright. <laughs> she was looking sexy, something happened. Is that it already? That was pretty straightforward. We're just gonna ducky ducky down here. My gosh. Come on, there's gonna be two forms. That was interesting. No, I'm not gonna speed run this by tomorrow night. Hell no. And so Andrew says, more time to watch your streams as pause. There you go, man. That's a spirit. We're gonna be here every day, so don't worry. And uh, yeah, nothing but good vibes going your way, sir. You think she's a do- oh wow. Okay. Well, if it isn't Zangetsu, always glad to see an old war buddy who can still hold his own. I could say the same to you. You seem just as sharp as ever. Seeing as we share a common enemy, would you give me the honor of fighting alongside you again? Oh, there we go. Well, we got new buddies. You're one of the church's people. Sorry, Zangetsu, but there's no way I can trust someone from the church. Come on, you'll be fine. Oh, there you go. So we're all going to be friends, apparently. All right, that works out. Conrad says it's a lot of fun. There's some really good trout fishing in Table Rock Lake. I, have, I haven't been fishing in a long time. I'd like to do some more fishing. So let's see this guy's news. Sniper shot. Uh, y button. Okay. Prone. Oh, so you can go prone. Crawl as well. And you can wall climb, too. Wall kick. Oh, well, this guy looks... Pretty versatile, doesn't he? All right, let's go. Uh, yeah, Jacob, but just came... I mean, I'm in Australia, don't forget, so I get this a couple hours before you. Don't forget, one coin gets this a couple hours before you guys. Not trying to brag or anything, it just is what it is. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> one of the perks of living in Aussie, mate. <clears throat> oh, gosh, I need to take a deep breath. What else is happening, guys? Any other news for me? Malcolm, game's going really, really good, bro. As I said, I'm just trying to wake up for the day still. I'm feeling really, really flat. I did the right thing and went to bed early last night, and it was just one of those nights where I laid in bed for like three hours, you know what I mean? Just, uh, yeah. That's alright, show goes on. Cruz, thank you, man. Cruz has dropped 100 stars. This is for you. 
Leroy Jaqua ah, 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 Jenkins. Thank you, Cruz. Why am I so lucky, Nick? Oh my god, he just ran in. Thank you so much, Cruz. Cruz dropping a big hundred stars. Why why do you guys think I'm so lucky for? What did I do that was so lucky? And uh You think I've got exclusive content? No, you guys are gonna have this literally in like three hours. Don't forget we're a day ahead. Don't don't forget Aussie's a day ahead. It's the only reason I got this. Oh boy, deep breath, deep breath. And so Lynn says if you keep bashing your head like that, you're going to get a headache. Yeah, that's a big possibility in that, isn't there? Oh, wait, we could do these ones. Ah, look at this guy. I do like... Ah, hang on. So they, they can't... Okay, this is neat. Oh, we're going to give that back to him. So D. Wayne says Ricky swinging his blood stain in the breeze. Yes, I do know a thing or two about swinging it in the breeze. It has to be said. <laughs> oh, boy. You remember last year, the first one was free on Xbox for a while. Well, as I said, we're going to be playing the first game as soon as this is done. I'll be able to power through that one pretty quick. And so, Payron says you love doing not doing any more work. Are you retired again, Payron, or are you just having a break from work? Did, did you go back into retirement, sir? Why are you not working, Payron? Ah, oh, damn. Oh, boy. Jeez, I was so close to dying there. There we go. This guy can, like, wall climb, I think. There we go. We made it. And then Quincy says, call 1-800-BREE-SWINGING. So Conrad says, do, we, do I eat crawfish? We actually had this chat the other day. Um, I've never actually tried crawfish before, so I don't... Yeah, you guys are going to have to explain to me what crawfish actually is. Like, I think you guys told me, but I forgot. Fuck you, you jumping motherfucking hopping thing! Oh my gosh. Hi, my name's like to hops a lot. How you doing? Oh my gosh, stop hopping everywhere. It's making me angry. It does feel a little bit like Ninja Gaiden as well. Payron says he's just free balling right now. There you go. Just, just, just tell it to the world, Payron. Just tell it to the world, bro. Oh, son of a biscuit! All right. <laughs> Those are crawfish. Oh, crabby. Oh, crabby lobster things. Oh, fair enough. Crabby lobster things. All right. They're like mini prawns. Okay, well, Australians know a thing or two about prawns. There we go, we got this one. Jeez! I'm done with you, mate. Too many bats, bro. We're gonna somehow get up here, get that sunbish. Oh, come on! Is he gone? He's gone, alright, there we go. All max are hell. All right, cool. Wait, can we go back up here and get get any health by any chance? No. And uh, so that's what they call. Oh, yabbies. No, I know what yabbies are. Sure. I use. I use. Okay. No, I know what yabbies are. We used to find them on the beach, or well, some beaches, not all beaches. And uh, the stage is driving you batty. You could say that, mate. You could say, oh, we're going to jump over here. I don't think you can... I think you can wall jump. I don't think you can wall climb in this. Yeah, I, th I think it's... I think you can wall... They definitely turn the mechanics of that character similar to something like, say, Ninja Gaiden, right? Just trying to see if there's, like, a health potion here. No, it doesn't look like it. Shit. Okay, I'm in trouble. I'm just going to go down here and chill bang. <clears throat> so Derek says, what platform was re this released on? Everything. That's all I'm going to say. If people ask me what platform this is on, I'm just saying everything. Because it has been released on everything. Like everything modern. Whatever, whatever you play on modern, it's on. 
Easiest way to explain it, uh, rather than go through every platform. Ah, shit. Well, that sucks. Andrew says Ricky is a future boy. It is tomorrow here already. Damn it. Alright, we're gonna have to use our credit. That's fine. Mike says we would have been spoilt if we had graphics like this back in the 8-bit era. I agree. We don't have to go back too far, guys. We got this. This is a tricky game. This is definitely like the, the bosses, um... The bosses in this game seem a million times easier than the first one, but the levels are harder. So the levels are harder, the bosses are easier. That's that's kind of where I'm at with this game. And uh, what else, guys? You wish they'd give this a physical release. Did they give the first one a physical uh, release? I can't remember. Or was it was it only uh, Ritual of the Night that got a physical? There you go. According to this guy, we need to go downwards. There we are. Seth says, do I ever play Fax Xanadu? Maybe once or twice a year we do Fax Xanadu. I do really enjoy Fax Xanadu, but the game's hard as balls, and I don't retain a great audience when I play that game. But I would like would I like to do Fax Xanadu again for you guys? Absolutely, it's a classic. It's, it's, uh, it's really hard. Like when when you're spoiled with all these new games, it's not doesn't have the world's best mechanics. And uh, <clears throat> don't forget to keep smashing that thumbs up, please, everyone. As I said, brand new game today. Would love to get some sunbishes in here. Hey, go on, Benji. Good to see you. Yeah, I remember I got Fax Xanadu when I was, uh, I think I was 12 years old, so seventh grade, and I locked myself in my room for three days and beat it. I think over Christmas holidays. You think I should do Fax Xanadu for a late night stream? Yeah, we'll see how we go. I've still got to finish Walking Dead first, guys, so it'll be a little minute. But we'll get it done eventually. Do we just go across this way? Alright, we're up to the boss. Oh, hello! Alright. I don't know where I'm supposed to shoot. Is it the flower down the bottom? I mean, that seems pretty straightforward at the moment, does it? Oh, shit balls. Ah, crap. Alright, so far so good. We're just gonna have to... Alright, there you go. Oh, there we are. Ah, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Alright, cool. So we're just going to stay down here, I guess. That seems to be the secret. If you can keep getting your health back, this is easy. How you going, Nate? Good to see you. There you go. This is easy. I'm just going to keep using that flower here. Just keep giving it to this son, bish. He ain't ever gonna die. There we go, one more. There you go, we're just gonna be able to cheese that. That's pretty straightforward, man. That's just using your brains. So Randy Sylvain says you beat Faxanadu 32 years ago. Jeez, that was even longer than me, sir. I think I think we got this, guys. Now we just do one more flower power over here. There you go, get your health back, son, bit. Oh, fuck it, e, mate. Be a bit more careful there, bro. Alright, we've got, got one more. We can do this. Ah, damn it. Yeah, I did hear that they're making a brand new Tron movie. What's your thoughts on that, guys? I think a Tron, new Tron movie will be pretty sweet. There we go. We got him. So we better go back to this form. That was a bit tricky, wasn't it? Hey, you going, Jessup? Thank you for coming in. we got Gerardo in here. Yeah, so Seng says your old lady isn't going to be happy you're gaming too much, Rick Dog. I don't have a girlfriend, Seng, and I don't have a wife, and I can do what I want. It's a blessed position to be in. 
Would it, would it be nice to have a girlfriend? Absolutely. I think the chances of finding a girlfriend that understands my profession and how much I have to work at the computer is probably zero. She'd be like every day, Rick, why aren't you spending any time with me? And I'll be like, sorry, baby, but the Sunbish Army needs me. Well, it's either me or the Sunbish Army. And I'll be like, see you later. Have a nice life. That's a bit rude, isn't it? <laughs> No, I knew what you meant, Derek. Jessup says, did I like the Tron reboot? To tell you the honest truth, I never saw the Tron reboot. I only, I've only seen the original many times. Singh says, regardless, you gotta take a break. I'd like to take a break, but there's no point while there's nothing to do, you see. I, 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 believe, I believe there's no point taking a break if, like, you can't make the most of it and really live life. So I'll have to wait till COVID's over. Fuck you, COVID! COVID suck a big fat dick! Alright, there we go, excuse me. <laughs> there you go, sorry guys, I just had to get that off my chest. That was a little bit vulgar, forgive me. Oh look, we're using this robot, Sunbish. What is this, Mega Man? Toot toot! Alright, so what, what's the specials? Y button, death from above, alright. Well, that's cool. All right. Derek says you finally got a job. Congratulations, my friend. <clears throat> and so, so Sylvain says, yeah, stay single. We don't want to see the end of the Sunbish army. Thank you, bro. I've got to work out where to use that guy. That looks like it's going to be a bit tricky. Yeah, Lynn brings up a good point. Lynn says if she misses you that much, she could just watch you on the streams. Exactly, huh? My, my ex my ex was in a long distance relationship and I'd never ever do that again but I have to admit that she 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 was okay because she watched me on uh, camera every day like all day every day so she kind of felt connected still which was kind of cool and uh, but yeah I, I, I won't I won't ever do long distance again like ever 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 so let's, let's see where we're gonna go over here. So Derek says, one coin's now daily in your life. Thank you, man. I'm just glad to have you in here always. Big thank you for giving this game. Oh, dude, I can't hit that little rat. Now we got to worry about sliding on this ice as well, which is a big pain in the butt. Sylvain says he's, he's, he's old enough to remember the first Tron movie in the theater. I can't remember where I first saw it. I think I first saw it on VHS. I'm going to go back up here. As I said, a big thank you for watching, guys. I really appreciate all of you. Oh, look at that! This guy can just bust through walls. Oh, wow. Okay, he's my favorite. I think he's officially my favorite now. I think we can hop across the spikes with, with, with old girl here. Okay, that didn't really work out. That's fine. We need, we need to get some health items. We'll get there. Matt says, what, you didn't know this was coming out so soon? Yeah, man, the, the 11th. Well, it's the 11th over here, so no. Nah. Is it the 11th? No, the 10th, sorry. NASCAR's the 11th. I've got NASCAR for you guys uh, tomorrow or the next day. Do I remember the movie Lawn Mower Man or the video game Lawn Mower Man? The, the, uh, the... <laughs> I was pretty impressed with the movie Lawn Mower Man. Like, the movie was kind of garbage. But the, the graphics at the time were pretty impressive. Uh, as for the video game Lawnmower Man, that was kind of a stinker. Sort of, it sort of sucked. Gerardo says, do I have Playboy magazines? Gosh, man, not anymore. I used to grow up with those sumbishes. Why are you asking if I have a Playboy magazine for? That's a weird question. I mean, there's some of the shit you guys are, seriously. <laughs> yeah. No, I know what you mean, Matt. This is just like an... Yeah. And Singh says, No, Rick Dog, take a break. Law Mower Man was freaky. It was back in the day. No, Rick Singh, we'll see you next time. Thank you for hanging out. Mikey says, Usually when his missus misses him, she either visits work with lunch or, adds in, or comes into a two-player game. See, that's nice. 
I have to admit I've had girlfriends in the past who were good sports and kind of made the effort to join in a two-player games even though they didn't really like video games. So that was pretty neat. It's always nice when they make an effort. Thank you, James. Once again, a big shout-out to James, moderator extraordinaire. Thank you for the plug, sir. Gerardo says I need to play Jackass the video game. You think so? So Gerardo says I'm looking forward to Donkey Kong Nintendo Online. Makes no difference to me because I've already got the game. I'm sure that'll make a lot of other people very happy, though. Look at that, crikey. That's like an Australian spider in that box, I think. It's like Aussie Spider, mate. So who remembers Edward Scissorhands? Absolutely, man. That, that movie's great. And, uh... Oh, deep breath, deep breath. Forgive me here, guys. I'm getting a little bit flustered, huh? All you awesome sumbishes in the comment box. As I said, a big thank you once again for coming in and allowing me to play this today. As I said, we'll be doing the first game as a bonus. So this stream... It's probably going to go for a good few hours. Um, fuck! And then I'll come on with a fuck! No, I'll come on with a bonus game tonight as well. Well, thank you, Billy. I mean, that's a nice sentiment, but pe people sometimes say that and don't mean it. Tr trust me, I know, I know people mean well when they say that, but most of the time it's bullshit. Num numbers don't lie, my friend. Numbers don't lie. <laughs> And so Conrad says you should go up and back down the stairs and what, get more heart containers? Probably. It's alright, I'm going to walk around with this beefcake. This guy is pretty freaking awesome. So Andy says Edward Scissorhands is one of your favourite movies. It is a very great movie. Oh boy. Yeah, no, no, I'm talking about the first one. Yeah, I'm doing Bloodstained 1 after this. We're we're not we're not we're not doing ritual of the night today. No, we're not doing that one. That'll take too long. Thank you, Gerardo. Gerardo says I crack him up. Well, that's what it's all about, mate. So we're all about good times here. I, I rage and get angry, so you guys don't have to. It seems like a good deal to me. I will right, we'll go back down here. What's weak, Billy? What's weak? I do, I do love the 8-bit chip, chip tunes in this. They never fail with the music, huh? So, so far our first impressions, this is level 4, and I have to say this is a pretty uh, successful sequel, guys. Um, I'm not going to lie. I do think the, the first one is probably a little bit better, but this is going to grow on me, I'm sure, just while I get used to it and stuff. He opens a lot of secrets in this level. Oh, okay, no, that's alright, Conrad. Conrad, guys, you guys are always like, Rick, do this, do that, not realising that you're on a delay. So, by the time I get your comments, I don't know what freaking room you're talking about, so... No, I'm just playing the game. We, we, can, you, we can all keep our backseat gaming to ourselves today. But thank you, as always, for everything, Conrad. The, back, the backseat gaming, I just sometimes like to feel games out, you know? Everyone's like, no, Rick, you're not doing it right. you got to do this, do that, and I'm just going to be like... Dude, seriously, if you don't like it, buy the game, turn on the camera, and you fuckers stream it too, okay? <laughs> oh, boy. Hey, Nick, thank you, man. Nick just dropped 100 stars. Nick, this is for you. Thank you. Thank you very much, Nick. Rick, go left and right while going up and heading down. Exactly. Adam says, do you know the way? I think we're going to find out. I think we're going to find out. Thank you so much, Nick. I hope you're having a great day, good sir. Oh, it doesn't... Alright, it well, looks like I'm going to have to use my bashy-bashy hands for this one. Oh, we got him. Yeah, $15 US this game is, guys. You know, I'll tell you what, this game is $15 US, but you know what's free? Liking and sharing the stream, yo. Oh, we got him. Ah, oh, crap. Just like a blind man in a strip club, Ricky likes to feel his way around. Oh, trust me. Imagine... Oh, gosh. Oh, we got him. 
Okay. So, so Gerardo says, be a party boy. Well, you want me to be a party boy? Where's the party at, first of all? Wasn't, wasn't, wasn't that the question Jagged Edge was asking? We're still asking that, that at like 25 years later. Hey, where the party at? Well, I don't know where the party's at. I've been asking for 25 years. Did anyone ever find out where the party's at? Uh-oh! Alright, hang on. Crap. Go back up here. <laughs> Quincy says you got a blind joke. Okay, don't do not do your blind joke. That, I think that's asking for trouble, Quincy. I do want to keep my show on the air. air. Thank you very much, bud. Uh, there'll be no blind jokes today. <laughs> I tell you what's not no joke. Uh, Aaron has just dropped a very, very, very generous uh, 2,000 stars. Aaron, thank you once again for everything you do, my friend. That is absolutely incredible. And we're going to have a bit of a dance concert here for you, Aaron. This is for you, my man. That's an incredible donation. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, brother. I really, really appreciate that. How are you doing today? Everything all right with you, Aaron? I'm, um... Thank you again, brother. Sylvain just asked me if I like the Cuphead game. I do like Cuphead. Cuphead doesn't always like me too much, but I think Cuphead's a great game. We sometimes put that on as a bonus. Hope you're doing as well, uh, well as well, Kevin. Thank you for coming in. That is the Nintendo 64 pod racer. I haven't had a chance to practice yet. But uh, I'm trying to get it ready for a future stream for you guys. So yes, it is the Nintendo 64 pod racer that just got fucked. I mean remastered, not fucked. Excuse me. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh gosh, me and my potty mouth. Forgive me, everybody. How you going, Pack? Good to see you. Too many jumpy, jumpy things. We've got this big robot guy. I think they're gonna. Be, yeah, I think this guy is gonna be more effective in that section. All right, here we go. Oh boy! So here we go. At least this is checkpointed. This is the main thing. I'm just gonna try and keep getting my health. Oh, there we are. Look at this. Now we're talking. All right. We we might actually be able to beat this boss uh, here. How you going, Patrick? Good to good to see you. Once again, I just wanted to say a big hello to you, Patrick, just in case you missed me last time. I hope uh, your day is going well. You'll have to fill me in on what's happening. Hey, go on, Will. Good to see you. We're just doing the new Bloodstain 2, my friend. Curse of the Moon number 2, everybody. Let's see what we got over here. Oh, my gosh. It's going crazy. All right. As I said, I was trying to tag this game individually, but there was no tag, so I had to do a Castlevania tag today. You can keep using invincibility with this guy, so all we need to do is keep... Yeah, she can't hit me when I've got invincibility on. This is going to be really easy. Yeah, just... Man, this is easy. Just got to use this guy's ability, and that's it. Go use a spell. Why? Oh wait, I've run out of spell. Shit. It's all right. I'm still gonna beat her though. That's it. She's done. And these bosses are very straightforward today. Off with her head. There you go. She's got no head, but she's still got her big biddies. I mean, that's priorities, right? Jeez. Oh wait, there's a second form. Oh, that's fantastic. So what? Do we have to hit her in her biddies now, or what? Where do we... Oh, we got to hit her in the teeth. That's like that movie Teeth. Have you seen that movie Teeth before? The less we talk about that movie, probably the better. Damn it, that's not even a final form, mate. Alright, so we're just going to... We're, we're going to be able to get her. It's fine. I mean, this guy's got a ton of health, so it's no problem. There you go, that's all done. Jeez, mate. I know, Mikey, and I tell you what, bro, it's not on purpose, it's completely by coincidence, too. So, Big J thinks I'm trying to be Ed 209. Yeah, but without the guns, I guess. Hey, go on, Jared, good to see you, thank you for coming in. Damn, man, that boss had two forms, I guess they're only getting harder from here, hey? 
What the, what the hell's this, Sambish? You got the Solar Racer. There you go, you don't want to mess with one coin, he's got the Solar Racer, mate. So we can pick just what spell we want. Alright, I guess we'll use that. We'll keep going this way. And Mike says, Ricky, don't talk, it's a trap. I oh, know, it's starting to feel that way, dude, seriously. Alright, we're at camp. I don't know how many levels there are in this. There's different chapters to do, and it looks like each chapter has like five stages each, so... I'm guessing this is the final level of this chapter. And, uh, yeah. Alright, interesting. Alright, let's just see how we go. This looks like a pretty spooky level, huh? So Jared says, am I liking this better than Ritual of the Night? Oh, bro, it's hard to compare the two because this is a casual game. And Ritual of the Night is like a, like a 15, 20 hour long RPG. So it's not really a fair comparison. Uh, but compared to the first Curse of the Moon game, this is very good. It's very good. We'll see what the later levels are like after this. Yeah, how you keeping, Josh? I you hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming in. Yeah, Jason, I just picked this up. Yeah, today. As I said, forgive me if I get a little bit caught up in concentration. This is one of those tricky 8-bit games after all. Uh, do you reckon we'll end up getting another Diddy Kong Racing game, Mike? <clears throat> and Quincy says, watch out for the lady traps. Is that what we're calling him now, is it? Wow, that was close. Buy a lottery ticket, Rick. I need, I need the big jumpy jar shit balls. No worries, Rick, just burn up in the lava, it's all good. Oh, here we are. Oh, that's a bit better. How you going, Malcolm? Everything alright with you? I'm glad you guys are liking this on First Impressions. As I said, share this with as many people as possible. Let them know that this brand new game's out. I think it's really, really important we show as many people this game as we can as a First Impressions. And uh, they can decide if they want to purchase it themselves or not, hey? Payron says, the floor is lava, Rick. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Uh, I don't know whether to call Payron Captain Obvious or Captain Hindsight. This is for you, Payron. Thank you, my friend. Really appreciate you today, Payron. Thank you so much for all the love, my man. And, uh... You're like, yeah, man, I'm really, really digging this. I'm gonna have to go back to this chick. Man, there's a lot of... You can tell this is a final level, can't you? So I don't know how many chapters there are in this game, but I'm, I'm guessing the structure in this one's different. So, like, obviously this first chapter is really, really easy. And then the, the following subsequent chapters, you can tell the bosses and uh, levels are gonna get harder, so... We'll just have to see how we go. We're definitely going to at least do one more chapter after this, and we'll take it from there. I wonder how many levels there are in this game total. Looks like there's probably going to be about 15 or 20. So I don't know, man. I'm, most of my characters are out of health now. This is not good. Right. Oh, shit. I could have given that to someone. That sucks. All right, here we go. Josh, as you know what the candy is life right now, the Lifesaver gummies, trying your hardest not to eat the whole bag. Bro, I, I used to love those back in the day. Lifesavers, when I was a kid, were very popular in Australia. The code is boobies today. That's a, that's a, that's a, the magic discount code. Oh my gosh. Come on, Rick, you can do this. Just try, as I said, just trying to patiently wait. Oh, crap. Ah! Alan says those fireballs are stolen from Life Force. You know what, Alan? I was thinking the exact same thing. That's exactly where they looked like they came from. That's exactly where they looked like they came from. What does that thing do? Oh, there you go. We need to give that to this sub. Oh, shit! Uh, alright, we're gonna have to recover. Booby, boobies love Rick all day. Like, 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 last time I looked, there was no boobies motorboating. Never mind. I, I think, I think you guys think I'm more studly than what I am. Just saying. Okay, here we go. We have to go all the way back here now, Alan. 
We'll try and be a bit more careful this time. This is the last level after all, hence why it's tricky. Last level of this chapter, I should say. Alright, there we go, some health back. Oh gosh. At least you can farm those little pits and just keep getting your health back if you need to. It's kind of like Metroid, they're like those little pits. Apparently we need to go upwards, but I don't, I don't know how to get up there. Let's just go this way. Vincent says, yo, yo, Ricky. I can't stay up late, but to kick the game's ass, I will definitely try to, Vincent. Thank you very, very, very much for the 100 stars. Vinny, this is for you. Thank you so much for the 100 stars, Vinny. I really appreciate you today. Thank you for, for checking in, brother. Hope you get that rest, man. And, and uh, J J Justin says uh, he needs to get this game. Dude, you really do. I feel like there's going to be a lot more game time in this one compared to the first one. It's definitely harder. It's, it's definitely harder. Oh, crap. Alright, just get out of here, Rick. Is there any help over here? Of course there isn't. Gosh, that was annoying. Alright, come on. Oh boy. Ah! Oh, dude. Seriously. Alright, we're going back over here. There you go. When you got that orange glow on, you're invincible, which is really handy. Alright, which, which one are we giving this to? This Zangetsu? Alright, here we go. We got this. Jeez! So, yeah, no, you can get this on the PS4 platform. I just chose the Nintendo uh, Switch version because I wanted to travel with this, you know what I mean? That's all. Ah, damn. Keep calm, Rick. Keep calm. Alright, I'm just going to shoot him from here. That's no big deal. Oh, dude! Get that sunbish! <clears throat> so, Josh says, Ricky, I wanted to tell you the other day, do not ever get discouraged when someone says your content is stale. Oh, man. It's just, uh... You know what? The people just have a very high expectation of me. But at the same time, no one has a higher expectation of one coin than one coin. And, you know, I, I put in... When you put in 100% effort and things don't always go the way you hope, uh, it's definitely a very, very big test sometimes, you know what I mean? But, you know, thank you, man, for the encouragement. We'll get there. It's, it's one day at a time, my friend, one day at a time. There you go. I'm just filling everyone's health back up. All right, that'll do. Let's go. <clears throat> Can you use a Corgi? I mean, I haven't gotten that far yet, but we can work on it. Sandblaster Gaming says, you got this. These are your games. Oh, yeah, man. But, you know, the, the thing is, when I usually play Castlevania, I have save states. There's no uh, there's no save states or rewind feature on this Sandblaster Gaming, so I'm all on my lonesome, you see. Boobs plap. Well, Commodore already tried to uh, play a, a porno game for the Facebook algorithm, and he got banned for 30 days. So I already used uh, Commodore as my guinea pig. So there'll be there'll be no boobs on Facebook. Although, just, just ask D Wayne. We saw some dude a couple weeks ago play the full-on orgy scene in God of War, and uh, he uh, he didn't get banned. And it was yeah, man. There was just like vaginas and boobs everywhere, and he still did. I don't know. Bit of a double standard, I'm just saying. Okay, we better go back down this way. Oh, do you? Oh, yeah, that does look a little bit like a corgi. Sorry, I didn't even notice. That does look like a corgi, even though we're a robot. It makes no sense. But anyway, whatever. Oh, boy. Yeah, it is a corgi. What do you play? I want a Commodore play, a game called Bubble 2000. <laughs> Check out Bubble 2000 on YouTube and get back to me. Ah, oh, damn it. Come on. We got him. And, uh, have I ever played Oddworld? I have played Oddworld a couple times, Michael, but I absolutely suck at it. That is definitely a D-Wayne game. 
Oddworld is uh, 100% a D-Wayne game. Oh, dude, I pressed double jump. Why did that not work? Brothers, brother, I'm not going to go that way. I'm going to go the long way. Rutherford, happy birthday for Sunday, my mate. Hope you have a great celebration, sir. Looks like we're going to have to go the long way here, but no big deal. I'm just going to take the hits, guys. Sometimes the best strategy is just to not be there, huh? Did we just go backwards? I better not have. Dude, we just totally went backwards. So I've got no choice but to go that... Oh, gosh. This game is being tortured now. It just looped me. Oh, man. This is rough. It's fine. Gosh, come on! There we go, we got him. Alright, so at least we're going to go out this door. So I'm going to have to die on purpose, I think. Let me just, uh... Oh, Alright, let's just try it. Screw it. That didn't work out, did it? Alright. I, I forgot I can give everyone their health back. So, I mean, hooray for me. Give the other dude his health back, too. It's a long process. What are you going to do? And, uh... A big thank you for coming in. You have to forgive me, guys. I'm a little bit sleepy today. I'm trying to do my best to host this show. As I said, try to do all the right things. Went to bed early last night, but my body said, Yeah, no, you're not having any sleep today, Rick. It was one of the... Oh, dude. Fuck! Alright, one more time. Yeah, it's gonna concentrate a little bit more, huh? Ah, damn it. Ah! Alright, at least we're gonna be able to continue from down. Oh, shit. This is Man, this level is fucked, bro! Alright, we're gonna go back there one more time, everyone. Jeez. Alright, just, just keep go, go, We're gonna go back up there, apparently. I, I, I don't know. Is, it, can, is there a, a trick to this? No, I can't get up there. Yeah, that's it. Don't forget to copy and paste. Show your friends. Absolutely. Yeah, Cat, have a good sleep. Thank you for coming in. Appreciate you coming in today. Come on, Rick. Alright, we're almost at this next bit. Almost at this next bit. Here we go. Is this it over here now? Yes, it is. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. That was close. Jeez, man. That is that is rough. Oh, gosh. All right, here we... Oh, my gosh. Thank God, man. That, that, that level was really starting to piss me off. All right, we made it. <laughs> it's like fifth time's a charm there, guys. We made it out. Oh, damn. I forgot to give everyone their health back. Ah! Sean's going to bed, too. All right, Sean. We'll see you next time. Thank you for hanging out. And here we go, we got Perry in here from the Global Stream Machine. Thank you for hanging out, Perry. Hope you're having a great day too, sir. Big shout out to the Global Stream Machine. Yeah, man, this is, um... This gets a solid 7 or 8 out of 10 for me, sir. So they've done a really, really good job on this one. Right, now let's see what we can do. Oh, look, wakey, wakey, kill the snakey. Alright, let's go.
So how am I supposed to get that sunbish? How am I supposed to catch him? Alright, so we just supposed to wait over here for... Oh, there you go. I've used all my magic now, so I'm screwed. So, alright, so what? I'm trying to figure out the pattern here still, guys. Not, not really obvious, is it? Oh my gosh, well, how, what am I supposed to do? Can anyone see the pattern? Alright, I mean, we'll just stay here. That works, doesn't it? That works, I guess. Right, we'll just try and jump underneath him when we can, alright. Just get as close to him as possible. Well, there you go. That didn't really work out, did it? Holy shit, man. Alright, here we go. Oh, I can't use a special anymore. Oh, boy. Alright, now what? Oh, okay. Well, I didn't realize he was going to be over there. Oh, damn. Damn! <laughs> Well, at least he was almost beat. Alright, I'm going to die on purpose and respawn all my characters, guys. I don't have a choice. I hope I don't have to go back too far. We're going to try that one more time. Thomas, I'm doing okay, man. This game has just kind of got me by the balls today, but that's okay. So, Gerardo says too many balls there is. So, J D. Wayne says he's making new soul-haunting screens. There you go. Scar people for life. That's a way to make them become followers. <laughs> yeah, scar them for life, mate. Perfect way to get a brand new follower. Oh, we got him. Alright, cool. Let's try this again. Alright, so at least we're straight at the boss. So we should be able to figure this out. It's alright, we can do this this time. We're just going to get underneath him and keep whacking the head by the looks of it. Now, I'm not going to use a power-up from that little Corgi. I'm going to use the girl's revival powers instead, I think. Keep going, Rick. Where is he now? Alright, there you go. So, that's, I mean, that's pretty straightforward. There's certain times you can hit him and certain times that you can't. So, we're just going to go back over here. See, that's pretty straightforward. Nothing wrong with that, guys. We, we got it sorted. Yeah, man, it's a great start. Can't complain about that, huh? Oh, boy. What, what's, what's... Okay, you know, just chill bang. Yeah, now that's easy, man. So you're just gonna, just gonna ride the wave, literally. Alright, so what are we gonna do here? Alright, so we're just going to use this. Alright, cool. Ah, crap. Alright, keep going, Rick. Now where's he going? Shit balls. Ah, oh, come on. Just... There we go. Almost there, everybody. Almost there. Come on, Rick. Ah, shit. I'm in trouble. Okay, come on. We're so close to killing him. Just a few more. Ah, shit balls. Come on, dude. This is nuts. Alright, hang on. Oh, boy. Alright, that's it. Is that it? Is that it? Or do we have to do this again? Now what? Wait, I just killed him. Now where's he going? Of course that's not it. That would be too convenient, wouldn't it? No, he is dead. Have I ever heard of phobia? I know what phobia... What do you mean for... I don't know, no. Tracy says, stick a move, stick a note. Thank you, Tracy. There you go, guys. It took all my co uh, all my concentration there. Oh, boy, that was nuts. 
Oh no, apparently... So this has all been saved. So what, do we have to go another level across? Okay, we're not done yet, apparently. Okay. Well, let's keep going, I guess. It looks like you can play this two-player. Yeah, I, I didn't realize that this was multiplayer as well. That, that's pretty interesting. Well spotted. I wasn't paying attention to that. Yeah, Tracy, we got there in the end, huh? You know what that means. The bosses are only going to get harder from here on out. As I said, they all look pretty patternized. No big deal. There you go. Let's go in here. I beat his corn arts. I don't even know what corn arts are, but we certainly did beat them to oblivion. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, boy. You wanted to sweep the leg, but there was no leg. It was Lieutenant Dan. New legs! No, don't forget, Lieutenant Dan got new legs. At the end, Lieutenant Dan got new legs. Then they're not the same legs as everyone else's, but they're still legs. New legs! Lieutenant Dan, new legs! <laughs> yeah, so Tracy says you could thank you, Tracy. I hope so! I just want to put on a good show. Let's do this. As I said, you can help by liking and sharing everybody. As I said, thank you so much for watching today. Just one more reminder, if you're looking to play this game yourselves, it comes out in the United States. Um, probably in about four, uh, 50 minutes, it's probably going to unlock for you guys on the East Coast anyway. Uh, Alright. Yeah, about 50 minutes, I think, on the East Coast, you guys are going to have access to this. You can watch Forrest Gump over. It's such an incredible movie, isn't it? You know, Forrest Gump had so much going on, and he just simped so much for Jenny, who didn't give a shit about him until the end of the movie, when it was convenient for her. Like, Jenny kind of really pissed me off, to be honest. Forrest Gump, oh, you know what? I want to do sex, drugs, and rock and roll. Oh, I'm sick now, and I've hit the wall. Okay, no, Forrest Gump, you can now have me. Fuck off, Jenny. If I was Forrest Gump, I would have been like, Jenny, fuck off. See, like, seriously. But anyway... Mind you, I do have sympathy for Jenny, though, because she had a, a, a turbulent upbringing, obviously, in the movie. So I do have some sympathy for her. Her, her piece of shit dad really messed her up. So I guess she gets a pass. <laughs> Jenny? Yeah. Anyway, there you go. Maybe I'm just a bit too harsh. I don't know. What else is going on, guys? Don't forget, we are streaming live on Facebook and YouTube. You can watch on the platform of your choosing, guys. Link to our YouTube is uh, pinned in the description. I recommend you jump over there and uh, subscribe if you can. And uh, you wonder if Silver's coming to Cobra Kai Season 3. The big rumor I heard is that Season 3 and 4 have all already been filmed. Oh, look, this is like Mega Man. Disappearing Bricks. This is fantastic. So, so Michael says, not Castlevania, but close enough. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, we did this. All right, cool, we made it. Uh, this is on all modern consoles, LA Evans. All modern consoles, sir. Have to go the long way. There's like a secret way to get up there, but I don't know what it is. Yes, yeah, it's on all modern consoles, guys, because I'm not going to go through every single fucking console. Just everything. <laughs> so I've got to go in that door too. Okay, I guess we have to keep going the long way. You think Forrest Gump was simping? Forrest Gump, like, is the biggest definition of a simp because he had so much uh, going in his life and then he just kept chasing after a girl who didn't give a shit about him. That kind of bothered me. Going back down here. 
Disappearing bricks here, yeah, they're always a good time, aren't they? Back down here. <clears throat> what else is happening? What do we got? Everyone on YouTube's pretty quiet at the moment. Don't forget, I'm going to be streaming all night. I'm going to be coming on with some late night games after this as well. Probably some fighting games, because I feel like I've alienated some of my audience with this one. And alright, let's see how we go over here. Hopefully these don't do... Okay, we're just going to jump as quick as possible. No big deal. And uh... Oh wait, okay, that's cool. Well, that's going to get us out of a few problems here. Sandblaster Gaming says it's enjoying it. Yeah, most people are pretty chillax tonight, I think, huh? What's happening on the global stream machine tonight, by the way, Perry? You guys got anything coming a little bit later on? And uh, speaking of awesome pages, we've also got the Retro Game Age. Always good to see you, Tommy. Thank you very much. Tommy just dropped a big 100 stars. This is for you. Everyone say a big hello to Tommy. Now, uh, Tommy plays many games, but Tommy is the premier uh, Pokemon streamer on Facebook, hands down. If you want to see everything Pokemon, guys, check out the Retro Game Age. Glad you're in here, Brosef. Thank you for visiting today. And, uh... It, it is normal. But, you know, I think some people seek to, like, continue the patterns. And that's where you've got to sort of, like, reevaluate things. Trust me, I've been that person. Uh, I've spent most of my life chasing after people I probably shouldn't have. Almost a thousand days, yeah man. A oh, Wolfman may make an appearance, there you go. Mod Michael, he's in more nicknames than... Uh, I tell you what, Mod uh, freaking Michael's got more nicknames than a heavyweight boxer, mate. <laughs> Let's go back over here. Alright, cool. So hopefully we're almost up to this boss. At least there's another checkpoint. Hey, go on, Marky. Good to see you. Did I see Alonzo is coming back to take Ricardo's seat at Renault? That is incredible news. Ricardo is going to McLaren, right? Isn't Daniel Ricardo going to McLaren? Did I hear that correctly? I'm glad Alonso is coming back. Uh, I think he's got a couple good years left in him. Hopefully hopefully he's still really quick. Do you, do you guys think McLaren can come good again? Like, McLaren have had slumps before. Hopefully they get over this one. Ah, shit balls. Alright. I kind of lost concentration there. Ryu, Ryu is not in this game, no. Oh, I'm just going to wait for a sec. I'm gonna put on my invincibility here, then if that guy hits me, it's not the end of the world. Ah, oh, shit! Alright, I'm gonna have to checkpoint this asshole. Hang on. One more time. Oh, wait, we could just chill bang up here and. Okay, I get it. I get it now, we're supposed to wait. Ah, fucker! Damn! Alright, well, we'll do this one more time, but I don't think we're going to make it across without a continue now. Oh, you can't even shoot upwards with this sunbish. That's that's going to be a, an aforementioned problem. Damn it. Timmy just dropped a big 100 stars. Timmy, this is for you. Thank you so much, sir. Oh, here we go. We got the checkpoint now. Thank you so much, Timmy. I hope work's not treating you too crazy, brother. Thank you for hanging out. How much data do I use to stream? Oh, dude. Um, with every dual stream on the quality that I'm on, you're probably using about 20 gig. 10 to 20 gig, probably. Probably about 10 gig a stream, dual streaming. If you're on one platform, probably about 5 gig. Give me one second here, guys. Just trying to concentrate. Just waiting for these uh, platforms to reappear here. There we go, like that. Oh, we made it. Damn, bro, that's nuts. 
All right, just patiently chill, chill banging over here. There we go. And he says he's good. He's just relaxing. That's a spirit. Oh, we made it. Apparently, we were supposed to go up, but YOLO. We'll just go the long way today. Oh, boy, this is hard. Tracy says, you got this, my dude. This has taken so much concentration. Like, the first game I can play with my eyes closed because it's muscle memory, but this game, being, being, being the, 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 the first first time, is a bit of a learning curve, you know? But we're figuring it out. This could be a lot worse. Retro Game Age with another 150 stars. Thank you, man. Retro Game Age says, have a great night, Ricky. We were talking you up in the stream today, so you thought I'd drop by. Thank you, man. I'm always talking about you in here as well. I don't know anyone that does Pokemon on the internet better than you. As I said, guys, please make sure you check out Retro Game Age for not only great content, but great production as well. This is going out to you, sir. We'll see you again soon, brother. Have a great night. A uh, big congratulations to Retro Game Age for almost a thousand days as well. That's pretty incredible. And uh, don't don't forget, guys, it's not too late to like and share the stream too. That will really, really help us out today. So Mark says, what's the name of this game? Uh, Bloodstained. It's uh, Bloodstained Curse of the Moon 2. Uh, you can get one and two now. I just need to focus here for a second. Bear with me. Can you imagine if we had knockbacks turned on? You can actually play this with knockbacks as well. That would be a, a bit too crazy. Oh, we made it. There you go, guys. All done. Pay them cornflakes for stars. We're going to have a little bit of a Resident Evil day tomorrow. Uh, I'm probably going to do Resi 7 again. I haven't done Resi 7 for a little while. And then we'll do our usual speed run. Not sure what I'm doing on Saturday yet. I still have to figure it out. I'm on a zombie kick. I've been practicing a lot of zombie games lately. Oh, here we go. We're up to the boss. No, no worries, Mikey. Thank you so much for coming in. We'll see you tomorrow, hey? Oh, wait, so we got to hit these pillars back there. Man, this is rough. Alright, trying, trying to work out what to... Do. Oh my gosh, trying to work out what to do here. I just keep shooting him in his sunbish head. It's not really doing a whole lot of damage, though, is it? Ah, oh, shit, come on! Can, can we hit these things? Okay, we can. Well, that, that's good to know, isn't it? Come on, just keep doing these ones. There you go. Just keep feeding myself health and I should be okay. I keep... Alright, come on, Rick. Alright, there you go. Almost got full health back. Alright, so oh, dude! This is weak. The bosses in this one are definitely trickier in the first game. Ah, crap! I didn't think so at first, but they are. Oh, there we are. Oh, come on, Rick. I'm in trouble if I don't get this sunbish now. There we go. Come on. Give me a sec, everybody. Oh, boy. Almost got him. Come on, we can do this. Oh, shit. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, boy. Go back to this guy, I guess. Alright, that's alright. That's gonna work out. This guy works too. Holy shit. It's crazy. 
It'd be nice to get him first try. I mean, I think we can... Ah, oh, damn, I missed it. Don't screw it up, Rick. He's so close. Oh, crap. Come on, Rick. Ah, damn it. I have to go back to her. Shit. It's a little bit harder with that robot guy for some reason. Oh, damn it. Come on, dude. It's just getting harder and harder to grab her for some reason. Or him, or it, or whatever it is. And then Steve, thank you, man. Okay, hang on, Steve. Give me a sec, bro. I can't pause in the... Oh. Steve says he did a test on your stream equipment today. You need to play with the sound and make something to fill the empty space like an overlay or something. Steve, I can help you out with that if you want to give me a show later on. Steve, this is for you. Thank you, my friend. Appreciate you. Mark says, what was the first game I ever played? Scramble on the Vetrex, Mark. Thank you, Steve. Man, I really appreciate the 100 stars. Man, yeah, if you need a hand, let me know. So hard just to get these final hits in. It's probably just because I'm nervous. Oh, gosh. Oh, my dude. Oh, man, I'm screwed. I'm so screwed. Right, why is these, these last hits so tricky? Oh, come on, dude. Oh, man. I don't go... Oh, gosh. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, here we go. I can't believe I can't... Oh, dude, I can't get up there! making me want to rage quit so bad right now. Oh my gosh. This is it. This is going to be like my last chance. Oh, dude. I, I, have to, I have to reset, guys. I have to do this whole fighting. That, that's bullshit. I can't believe how hard those final hits were. I don't know what I was doing wrong, but... Son of a bitch. Alright, let's do that boss fight again. I can't one it was like one hit left, guys. That'd be right, knowing my fucking luck. Alright, here we go. Try one more time. I'm glad you find it funny, Conrad. Alright, we're gonna go back over here. The at least at least we can do that health uh, trick with that chick anyway. Timmy, thank you, Timmy, dropping the 100 stars. Timmy, this is for you today. Thank you very much, Timmy. Thank you so much, Timmy. I really, really appreciate you. Oh, boy. This is taking it out of me today. Hopefully we can have a good start. Let's just go back to the chick. I couldn't get it. I couldn't... Yeah. I'm, I'm sure at the beginning it's easier. I'm going to work this out. I mean, yeah. See, we just got four hits in straight away. I don't know why we couldn't do that to begin with, but whatever. Alright, see, there you go. Good start. I'm gonna go back over this sunbish. Hey, go on, Johnny. The game is incredible. It's it's pretty tricky. The boss the the boss fights are giving me a bit of a hard time today, sir. I'm not fuckity. Not gonna lie, man. The boss fights are pretty challenging. Alright, there we go. This will definitely help out this sub weapon. Why, why don't we have this last time? That that's a big difference maker, isn't it? All right, cool. All right, no worries. Uh, I. Okay, that 
wasn't the right way, that's fine. Use this plant, get some health back. We're so close, guys. We're gonna get it this time. Oh boy. This, this is certainly taking more skill than I usually have, that's for damn sure. Oh my gosh, we did it. <laughs> Bro, you used to play those from software games, had you wanting to spike your controller. Yeah, Conrad, I learned how to spike my controller from a very, very young age, I feel you. That, yeah, hey, how you going, Dad? We've got one coin only senior in here, guys. Everyone say hello to Dad. Thank you for coming in. Yeah. Well, I mean, Fettle's a little crybaby. I don't really have that much sympathy for him, especially since he's like doesn't need to race anymore if he didn't want to anyway. It's not like it's really going to affect his back end all that much. <laughs> yeah, Thomas, we finally got him. Alright, there's another level. It, look, it looks like this is a full chapter, so I'm not going to do another chapter after that. This, I'll save it for another stream. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, just go straight on to the first game after this is done. Hey, going, Andy? Hope you're well. Oh, wait, oh, wait you're saying hello to Dad. I was going to say, I've already spoken to you today, Andy. You're pretty awesome yourself, Tracy. Damn it. Fuck. Ah! Alright, try this again. Oh, okay. Well, I can't go up. Where am I supposed to go? Just this way, I guess. Alright, well, it looks like one of my main dudes is dead, but that's fine. Gosh, I mean, I'm so clumsy. <laughs> Mark says, have a great weekend. See you on Monday, Mark. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, my friend. Again, thank you very, very, very much for hanging out today. Now, how, do, how do I go get that armor? There's got to be a trick to it. Right. Give me one second here. Oh, crap. All right, so we have to get that pixel perfect, I guess. All right, here we go. There we go, all defense up. That works. I knew I knew I just had to get that pixel perfect and no problem. Alright, we got this. Hey, we got the bearded gamer in here. Good to see you. Lynn says it's so cute that dad comes in to support me. Yes, I mean that's not the word a grown man's gonna use, but that's an appropriate word for a lady such as yourself. Thank you very much, Lynn. <laughs> it's always nice when the family comes in. We get my sister in here, my dad in here. Row in here. All right, we're gonna we're gonna try and jump this way. That's fine. We can do. Uh, I don't think we're gonna go that way. I think okay. Oh my gosh, this is tricky. All right, let's just keep going here. Just keep getting that health. So, Beta Gamer says this is such a fun game. It's it, as I said, this is definitely pleasure and pain. This game is really difficult. But you know, just like the other ones, once you figure out all the levels, I'm certain it's going to get easier. Now you're killing corgis? How dare you? I know. Won't someone please think of the children and all that business? Alright, back over here. Don't forget, guys, as much as I appreciate uh, likes and shares and everything, don't forget the best way to help us... Well, at least by likes and shares. What I meant is I appreciate star donations, but likes and shares are free. That's what I was trying to say. Uh, thanks to Steam? Why, why thanks to Steam? Did they only just get re-released or something? I thought they'd been up there for ages. So is there an easy way to get in here? Let's have a look. Can I? You can't jump off the staircase, can you? Or can you? Hmm. Well, I don't know how to get in there. Wait, I... Okay, I guess we have to go the long way. No big deal. 
Kevin says, did I see the latest trailer for Battlegrounds? No, I just saw, like, some more information, like, match types and things like that. It's basically just going to be, like, NBA Playgrounds, but WWE. Which I don't mind, actually. I'm down for another arcade wrestling game. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that. Oh, well, that's pretty cheap. Yeah, I guess they're pretty old now, so you can get a good price on them. Give me one second here. Big thank you to everyone who's watching on both Facebook and YouTube. Don't forget, we're live on both. So, Timmy says he's off to work. No worries, Timmy. We'll see you when you get back. Big thank you for coming in, man. What are we going to give to Timmy before he goes? We're going to give you this one, my friend. Timmy dropping a big hundred stars. Nothing in there. All right, I, I, I gained. I don't know how was. Apparently, this character can wall climb, but yeah, he, he can wall slide. He can't actually climb up. All right, looks like we have to go the long way again because I can't figure out the secret. <clears throat> oh boy. I, th I think after I do this stream, I'm looking forward to coming on with some fighting games and beating the hell out of people. Just saying. I think for the late night, we're going to... Oh, fuck, man. I think for the late night, we're going to come on with that. Uh... Oh, Jesus! I'm so close to rage quitting. I have to respawn my characters now. Fucking hell. No, I can't jump that high. Do you think I'm Michael fucking Jordan or something, Matt? Jesus. What do, we, what do you think this is? <laughs> Matt, Matt, Matt thinks I'm Michael Jordan. Oh man, they really thought out the level design in this one. Hey. The news trailer for Andre and Sergeant Slaughter. And I saw the pictures of Sergeant Slaughter. Bitter Gamer says, how's Australia doing? I don't know, man. I'm not outside all that much, to be honest. I couldn't even answer that question. <laughs> I'm honestly not outside that much. It's a, believe it or not, it's a harder, harder question to answer than you realise. There we go, we made it. Man, this is a really tricky sumbitious area here. Oh, that was close. Come on. Jeez, they're not making it easy for me today, huh? Oh, crap. Alright, so up... Oh, no way! Oh. Oh, this is crazy. I'm so close to rage quitting this, eh? Ricky is cranky today. Better do some jokes. Man, I just I just got to learn not to come on stream when I'm sleepy, I think. I'm just really, really... I'm just really, really tired today. And I know when I'm tired, less people want to watch. Oh, that's it. I can't keep playing this game. Oh, I'm just getting hit. No, I'm just going to call this streamer right off. Fuck it. I'll be back on for the late night. Back in about 30 minutes, guys. I can't do this anymore.